Hey everybody, today I am doing a review once and for all on the brush guards and I wish I had the little plastic bag that these still came in but I went and used that for something else. This is a product that I know I've talked about on and off but I haven't devoted a specific review to them and they are just an essential one-of-a-kind product that I have in my collection. I don't have anything else that does exactly what these do or anything I can use interchangeably with this. It's just, this is it. This is something I use. It has a very specific purpose. So brush guards come in different packs. I have a variety pack here. I actually was able to find this at Walmart for just under $5, but you can go to thebrushguard.com and I will look up any other websites uh, that sell these and link them below for but you. You can get packs of them and this this one, for example, the variety pack comes with an extra small, two small, two medium, and one large. So these are the brush guards, and they're these kind of stretchy, like remember that trick where you'd put your finger in the thingy and like, <laughs> what was that thing? You can see they're kind of stretchy, they expand, and these fit right around your brushes. Why would you want to use one of these? Well, I think they're good for travel. If you don't have a good place to store your brushes when you travel, or you've got one of those oddball brushes that doesn't fit in with your other ones, for example, this Kabuki brush that I like to use for like products all over my body. If I want to use a bronzer, you know, across my shoulders or something like that. I'm always traveling with this little guy, but it's he's pretty squatty. There's not usually a place in with my other brushes to put it. But when I stick it in the brush guard, um, none of the bristles are poking out. It's completely contained in there. It's not going to slide out. It's got a nice tight fit around the brush. And then when I want to use it, you just pull it out the other direction. And not only is your brush protected, but if it's spent some time in one of these, it comes out um, with a better shape too. And another way I like to use these is when I'm cleaning my brushes because um, I have certain brushes, maybe ones that I've had a long time or some of those goat hair bristles, you know, the lighter bristles that tend to, when you wash them, like the bristles start poking out in different directions and um, you start to lose the shape over time. And so when I use a brush guard in cleaning, I will use my Benjabel brush tree. There's a review on those if you're interested, but that's the little contraption that will let your brushes hang like this so all the moisture's seeping downward. Um, but if it's a brush that's got like those stubborn bristles, I take even the smallest one. This is the littlest guy and it's fitting right around there and then I poke it right up in the brush tree. And what's really neat about this is that this brush will completely dry, even with this thing on it, because it's open. Air can get to your brush, but it's gonna come out with the perfect shape. And if you don't have a brush tree, maybe you're cleaning a small amount of brushes, um, assuming you've got brush guards that are having a really tight fit on your brushes, you could even tip them downward and just put them in a glass. Um, air isn't gonna circulate through that quite as much as it would if it were just hanging the brush tree, but that's another option if you um, are cleaning some brushes and you're using the brush guard. I really think anybody with any amount of makeup brushes could probably find some great uses for these. And like I said, traveling with these, I've never had an issue. You know, these will keep your brush protected. These fit in such a snug way around the brushes and you got multiple sizes, you can figure out which one is going to give you, you know, the, the tightest fit, but yet can easily slide up and down the brush. And it's just so handy. And I just figured that for all all the times I use these. They're really an unsung hero in my makeup collection. I use them all the time. They're a one-of-a-kind product, but I don't often talk about them and how useful they are in the cleaning process and the traveling process. So the brush guard is what they're called. I'll have the links below. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you later. Bye!